welcome back. So today we are in my back garden and we will be doing another video of painting with acrylics. Now we'll be doing a significantly smaller one, a simple painting on a roughly A5 canvas. I found that the weather is really nice today. It is sunny and you can hear the birds, ignoring the background train and airplane noises. But I thought it would be really nice to do a painting video, something for a change in my garden. So yeah. let's hope there's not too many bugs crawling over the place although this is their home so we can't complain and let's start painting. doing a painting similar to one i found online after doing a lot of searching for ideas so it's the background of a ombre blue sky with a large moon in the center surrounded by some pink blossoms so i'm gonna kind of do my own take on that painting and let's see where it takes us. See, I don't take art GCSC or anything. Neither is art my strong point at all. Most of my human paintings, you could say, look like monsters. So let's just see how well I can try and paint today. So I've got my canvas. I've already somehow got some green on it. But let's try and ignore that. Start off with a dark blue top of the sky before we start our ombre. I'm going to mix this with a bit of white so i'm gonna do a lot of mix matching with colors and see where that takes us We have a little ant joining us today. I find the best way to paint is, although it might look very like strokey, you could say, is put dabs and then kind of brush them side to side, and that gets the paint off both sides of the paintbrush. And then we'll slowly go into like a greeny colour. What I've done is I've kind of continued this ombre going down. It looks more like a sea, but we are not finished, are we? So the sky is a different colour in this. And it kind of gets a bit darker at the bottom. But let's see how this turns out. I'm not going to really stop till it looks decent. So don't judge my art skills hands are in such a state right now i don't really know i forgot to bring a tissue outside so this is what happens what we've done is we have a circle that is roughly so that shape is going to be the moon here, and so. are we painting it white you can add shades of gray or some of the blue um add different textures to kind of make it look as realistic as possible so i'm carefully using my white paint to go all the way around the edges if i haven't already said i'm using acrylics here because that works best i find for paintings like this so work your way all the way around with the white paint and then fill it in but you don't want it to be like a matte complete white you want to kind of be able to see through it slightly to make it a bit more realistic and you'll see what i mean here Next, I'm going to be adding a bit of grass and a tree on the side. Now, this will be black because obviously it's dark, so it'll kind of be a silhouette. So I've added some strokes of grass along the bottom, and I'm going to have 
half of like a tree trunk with some branches coming out of it. This was kind of like my own take to the image that I was originally going to try and create. So that's how I painted this picture. Sorry, some of it got um, cut out because I ran out of memory space, so I had to delete stuff and so on. But we have a dark blue kind of ombre sky where it gets brighter around the moon. And we have a silhouette of a tree with no leaves. And there was some space, so I was like, why not put a flower in? Although the flower doesn't look the best, but I feel like something needed to go there. So... That was my painting. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if I should do more painting videos. I can do more of those. And if there's any specific painting you want me to try doing. Thanks for watching.